Morning. Uh, good morning. Well, how are you? First, early in the morning like that? Yeah, good. A little cold, but <laughs> good. Uh, what do we expect from you and Team Canada here? Oh, I think uh, <laughs> we'll have to see out there, but uh, yeah, I think we're all in for Mike and uh, yeah, hopefully he has good legs to, uh, to follow in the final. Good course for Mike? Yeah, I think for sure. Super hard, a couple punchy climbs, one longer climb. I think, uh, yeah, it's a really good course. Obviously, there are two, three names which are maybe above uh, the other of the favorites. So how to, to make the best race to avoid to, to, have a, to, to be the victim of the attack, if I can say? Yeah, yeah, I think it's, uh, I mean, I think we've seen it. It's a really hard course, but it's not maybe as selective as, as everyone else thought in, uh, in the other races. You know, it, it always came back together in, uh, in the other races. Um, but obviously, 275 kilometers, you never know, uh, you never know. So, yeah, I think uh, that's a road race. Anything can happen. You just got to try and be in the right position. We'll try and put Mike in the right position to, uh, to yeah, be up there. And yeah, I think the attacks are, are inevitable from the big guns. It's just, uh, it's just how the legs are going to respond to it. But do you think a surprise is possible? A surprise winner is possible? Today? I think for sure on this course, we've seen a a surprise winner can be possible. It's not as, as clear cut, especially with uh, not so many hills in the second part of the circuit. Um, yeah, it was a chance for other groups to come back and uh, definitely interesting final with no, uh, no climbs in the last couple kilometers. So for sure, I think there can be a surprise winner. Thank you, Derek. Best of luck. Have a great